Hey, welcome back at yet another video. I'm Auto from Banana Box Tag, and first off, I got my own merch. Yeah, it's limited to one quantity, but yeah, for me, it's still merch. Um, recently, it was Black Friday. My grandma wanted to have a new PC. She has momentarily a dual core PC with two gigabytes of RAM. It's really horrible and slow. Not my grandma, the PC. <laughs> but uh, for Black Friday, I watched the prices and I saw some great discounts. So I put together a new system for her and I will be building it, installing it, and I'm bringing it to my grandma, but that part I won't be filming. So yeah, let's start. I've chose for these parts, I got the AMD 3400G because I didn't want to put in a graphics card because that starts from around 100 euros so that will break the budget immediately. The budget was around 500 euros but I built the complete PC for 384 euros except for the cables and the fans, that was my little twist to it. But the memory, 3000 megahertz speed, 8 gigabytes, 2 modules. I got the modular power supply, or semi-modular, the 3400G with integrated graphics. That's way more than my grandma ever needs, so that will be enough. I got one of the fast NVMe drives. That's also more than she needs, but it was around, around I guess, 40 euros for 250 gigs, so that was great. Also the main board. Nothing special, it had all the fan headers I needed. The cheaper ones only had one or two fan headers, so I wanted to control all fans. Don't want to bother with any cables or fan splitters, so I went for this motherboard for those fans. So that's basically it. One of the things that really surprised me back in the day, Sharkoon was a brand for me that wasn't really quality or anything, but I bought this Sharkoon case. It's the V1000 with the window. I don't know why, my she keeps her PC in a wooden closet, so I needed to go for a PC with proper ventilation. I saw this case, I liked it, so I bought it. The only thing I didn't like are the thumb screws. Those are made from plastic, but the rest of the case, it really amazed me. Normally, as I said, Shakun, I don't know really the brand. I thought I knew it, that it was bad uh, quality, but hey, it surprised me. Even there are three fans included. Mind you, they are connected through Molex, so not through your mainboard. It's nice that they include three fans. A lot of brands don't. These are also transparent fans with blue LEDs. I thought they might were really bright, but in this case, they're really dim. Also, the side panel is acrylic, but it's tinted, so you don't really even see it. I had the system set up to, for a quick test and also to install Windows. For this video, I took it apart so I can rebuild it again. I should have done that the first time. But now I know that everything works and also the fans weren't that bad, but yeah, already ordered the Corsair ones. I will put all the links down in the description. And the last thing that also really surprised me, I'm a huge fan of cable mod. Also for my girlfriend, I ordered a cable mod set, custom cables for her PC. But this time for Black Friday, I was searching for cables with a discount. Sadly for the European store, they didn't have really a discount. But I found a brand on Amazon. They're called Easy DIY something, I believe, Easy DIY cables. They were 30 euros for a complete kit with two cables for your GPU and a 8 pin for your motherboard and a 24 pin. Those were 30 euros with all the cable combs you should need. Uh, also a DVD player, a CD player. <laughs> That's because my grandma still listens to music via CD. So this is my first build since years that I need to include a CD drive. So also this particular case has a CD drive bay. So that was also limiting my options. I wanted to go for the Meshify C. I still want to do a build in that one. But yeah, we have to wait for another day. So that's enough rambling from my side. Let's go ahead and build it.
So that was the build. This PC is going to my 88 year old grandma. She is going to use it for her email, some small games on her Facebook. So this might be overkill, but if you don't include the Corsair fans and the custom cables, then it was a PC around 390 euros in total, even with shipping. So I guess it's a decent PC, nothing that special. If she wants to upgrade it in the future, I don't think so. We still can add a video card in it or add an extra SSD. For now, 250 gigs SSD uh, is more than enough for her. I guess I will be putting on the side panel and I will bring it to my grandma and install everything for her. So that was it. Hopefully I will be building another PC soon. Someone heard I was building PCs and he also wanted to have a custom PC. So we might would do a video on that one. So for now, thanks for watching. I hope you like this kind of video. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe, do whatever you want. And I will see you the next time. Hey, bye.